some of my depression is um, triggered by events. Uh, I didn't get something that I thought I was going to get. Mm, yeah. uh, I lost somebody in my life that I don't know how I'm going to live without. Mm. But then I've also woken up and been like, I'm not okay, and I don't know how long this is going to last for. Right. Would you say that the, the depression you had after your mother died, was it your first bout of depression, or had you had experienced it mm, earlier? I never felt anything like this. Have you experienced it since? Uh, I mean, it lasted quite a long time. Yeah. It's, it's been a, it's been five years almost, and it's uh, it's 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 been almost five years uh, that I, that I, that I was in it and kind of still dealing with it. And just now, honestly, I'm feeling I'm feeling really good. Yeah. And 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 in a really cool way, and like almost like a kind of a zen sort of. Um, I don't know. Things seem brighter. I think there's something really important to talk about there. That this was a a causational with mm. the death of your mother. It was something you've never experienced before. You have no experiences mm. to show you that there's an end in sight. And I think that's where a lot of people mm. struggle with depression is because it is both how you get in it and how you get out of it just kind of feels random and sometimes feels out of your control. And for you to experience it for the first time to, and also be dealing with you know, the loss of your mother, there's something very inspiring about the fact that it, you were in it for a long time, that you were able to continue to work and continue to grow and find a different version of yourself in some ways coming yeah. out of it. And I, I do think there are benefits to analyzing these dark times that people go through and seeing how has it made me appreciate where I am now even more. Absolutely.